organized crime violence on the Taipei subway system tonight. Police say that a drug courier was attacked by members of a rival gang in an effort to destabilize the Triad Underground in Taipei. No civilians were hurt in the battle, but several men identified as Chinese nationals were among the slain. Chinese government officials today announced that the People's Republic would issue sanctions against any nation recognizing Taiwan as an independent state. The Chinese have always held the official position that Taiwan is merely a breakaway province. But with Taiwanese President Ronald Tsung's calls for official separation from the mainland, Chinese officials are growing nervous. When asked what form economic sanctions might take, the Chinese ambassador to the United States said, quote, We will take all actions deemed necessary and appropriate to safeguard Chinese sovereignty. In fashion news, designer Robin Goulet's latest show in New York was greeted with surprisingly mixed reviews. The focal point of the show was the controversial theme of ruined beauty. Models dressed in Goulet... Looks like Dang's men already made it here. How's that satellite uplink mean? Working. And you're right. Satellite imaging shows Chinese secret police all throughout the parks. We're a little late. Steven, what's it looking like near the stage? It's a madhouse over here. But not in that fun, violent way. This should be interesting. I hope our friends actually show up on time. Could use the helm. You better hurry, Mike. Sung's giving a speech in less than an hour. Speech? Weren't we here just for the fireworks? Yes, Mike. That and a little thing called regional stability. Those explosives are controlled from here. The bridge should be safe to cross now.
Fox. No contact so far. Awaiting your lead. Looks like some of Hongshur's men are pinned down outside the gate. You might want to help them out. This should come in handy. Who needs doors anyway? Gate should be all clear now. Hold up. Check on something in Investigating. Is a plan available for rapid deployment? Feeling more coming to join the party. Who the hell are these guys? They're backing me up, just like you are. Who the hell? 
held Lux death cannons to a hawk. This ding is crazy, Mike.
Doors open. We'll hold up Bang's men here.
Sun's coming onto the stage. It's a straight shot from where you are. I didn't think you were one to hide, dang. You're missing your big opportunity. Show yourself. No. It will be over soon. Sources made it pretty clear you were here to kill him. Then your sources are mistaken. If you're not the assassin. Oh shit. No. Damn it. I don't see anybody. I tried to warn him. I sent him everything I had on the assassination attempt. Mike, emergency frequencies are reporting riots breaking out. And they're getting ugly. Additional security forces are en route. Copy that. Omen, we've got trouble coming in fast. I'm guessing you want to get to the bottom of this as much as I do. Yes. Then let's move out. We're clear. Mina, I'm patching Dang into our connection. Can you give us an update? Reports are still sketchy, but the news is saying Sung survived the attempt. He was wearing a bulletproof vest thanks to a tip from an anonymous source. He survived? I'm glad the information I passed to him did some good, at least. Tragedy was averted today when an assassination attempt on Taiwanese President Ronald Sung proved unsuccessful. Government spokesmen say the president was warned about the attempt earlier this week by an anonymous source, which convinced him to wear a bulletproof vest during his speech. The president was taken to Taipei City Hospital, where he is reported to be in stable condition. News of the president's survival was not enough to quell riots that broke out shortly after the attack. Police say instigators within the crowd convinced spectators that the attack was part of a Chinese plot, which sparked the riot that has so far killed 23 people. Heck, calling Thornton. Come in, Thornton. Yeah, Heck, I'm here. Just a heads up, Mike. There's some folks out there that really hate you, pal. Tell me something I don't know. So this VCI comes to me and he says to me, Steve, I got a proposition for you. I always figured VCI as the offer you can't refuse types. So after I pop three of his fingers off for calling me Steve, I say, and what proposition might that be, my good man? Heck. This guy says to me, oh God, please don't kill me. I just came here to offer you five million dollars to give Michael Thornton up as Ronald Sung's assassin. Tell me you didn't. Not gonna lie, buddy. I was really tempted for a minute there. But I kinda like you, so I told him to piss off. Then I set him on fire to make sure he got the point. <laughs> Shouldn't you have stabbed him to make sure he got the point? I figured his cronies would probably try and find somebody less scrupulous than myself. So I went ahead and called the news stations. Should keep them off your back for a while. 
I appreciate that. Hey, no problem, buddy. I want to lay low for a while, but I'll be in touch. Be seeing you, Mike. Searching for a man called Wen Shu in connection with the attack. Government sources have told INN that Wen Shu is a Taiwanese national with no previous criminal record. The nature of his involvement remains to be seen. That should buy me a little time to get out of Taipei. Better get moving. And so this is the result of your efforts in Taipei. Chaos in the streets, an assassination attempt against the president of Taiwan. Well done. There was going to be unrest no matter what I did. Just an attempted assassination would be enough to create a panic. But with Sung alive, there's at least a chance of reining it in. Now you're beginning to understand. I admit, the lack of an identified assassin might slow things down, but the people already believed the assassin was a Chinese agent. Omen Deng's escape won't stop the push for independence from growing stronger. You managed to escape Taipei undetected, largely because of an anonymous tip identifying a man called Wen Shu as the attempted assassin. Stephen Heck's work, I trust? What can I say? The guy appreciated my style. You have a knack for engendering trust. A useful skill for an intelligence agent. Must be my winning personality. That's all you cared about, then? Destabilizing Taipei? You should pay more attention to global politics, Agent Thornton. If Taipei pushes for independence, the People's Republic will prepare for war. If China prepares for war, so does the U.S. And how Beck makes a fortune off the new Cold War. If there's one thing better for business than a war, it's a cold war.